welcome back to another week's worth of meals. Sundays I always try to cook a pretty big dinner. Was raised by Southerners and that's kind of our thing. So yeah. These were my first time trying these. I probably won't get them again. Um, they were just okay. I think I could probably do them better cooking them from scratch. So I used the same veggies, just switched up the thickness. One towel was going to be for my cabbage and then the other was going to be for the pork chops. Even though my pork chops have been marinating for about two hours, still hit it with some seasoning. So I want to know, even if you are using canned beans, you have to use those bay leaves, ladies. Have to. And garlic. Just another tip for you guys, always, always wash your rice. Um, all of that starch will come off and it will prevent it from being sticky. So this is a recipe I'm really proud of because I totally made it up myself um, and it turned out bomb, y'all. I did want to note that you would always want to use a fatty uh, hot link just so it can release all of that fat onto the skillet and the veggies. Only added about three teaspoons of this tomato sauce because I didn't want it to be too tomato-y if that makes sense. I wanted the Cajun spice to come through. Y'all, this was so good. I'm actually gonna make it this week again. It was just really, really light, if you can believe that, but very good. Box rices always look kind of gross and cray cray in the beginning. I will say Uncle Ben's wild rice is my favorite, but they always look super gross to me while I'm cooking. are the best fries I don't care what anyone says we can argue and fight about it they're way better than any fast food joint and always remember to soak your potatoes and get off all that starch so they can be nice and crispy when you bake them I'm usually a manwich girl but this was my first time trying to make sloppy joes from scratch that is a little bit of brown sugar I know super gross but it was a game changer and y'all again so good I think my little recipes are on point <laughs> I 
honestly, me and my wife both think that this came out better than Manwich. I'm telling y'all, it was so seasoned and so flavorful. Something I'm going to add to my normal rotation. Who doesn't like wings and pizza? Um, it was a Friday evening and we were gonna watch a movie, so I thought this would be the perfect meal to complement that. I season my dough I'm all about layering flavors and it's a must it makes it come out ten times better and for this particular dough you did have to bake it solo dolo for about eight minutes so it can cook all the way through when you put your toppings on was a pretty good meal I got no complaints thanks for joining me until next time guys bye